All right, so I start off with the drums and I just start off with the kick drum. So this is how it sounds. And then after that, I added the snare. Just a real simple pattern. And I'm just gonna keep on adding to it. So after that, get a hi-hat. Add on to it. With these fly low drums, you really want to have a variety of different percussions and hi-hats. After I got the drums, I went over to Omnisphere and I got this little string slash choir sound and this is how it sounds. So it's kind of weird, but it reminded me of something from Cosmogramma, which is ultimately the style that I was going for. So I layered some chords down and this is how they sound. After that, I went over to the operator and got a little saw and just played the same chords over it. So at this point, it's just a game of layering different sounds and I go over to Omnisphere again and I get this pretty unique sound. Let me show you how it sounds. So yeah, same thing, I added the same chords and I also added a few leading notes throughout the chords, so check it out. Then after that, I went over to Contact and got some roads and yeah, this is how they sound. After I got all of that, I decided to get a bass line and I wanted something that was a little fat, so this is the sound that I got. And this is the pattern that I got. simple I was just kind of going off the leading notes with that one and yeah after that I decided to sequence the beat so this is the intro I just start off with some basic percussions or hi-hats and then I slowly add on to it until all the sounds are playing with the drums then I add in some sounds and then it's just basically a gradual increase of sounds and building up to I guess you can call it the bridge Then right here, I add in the saw, and this is how it sounds. Then the bass line. Then after that, it goes straight into uh, like a little change up where everything calms down. Then I end the beat where we left off uh, at the change up and I change up the bass a little bit. Again, playing with the leading notes. 
So after I got all that, um, added the effects. So as you can see, I have compression right here. So I just made sure to do that with pretty much all the sounds. So after I did all that, had the effects, uh, basically uh, mixed the beat or whatnot. I added some uh, vocals and it's just some Dragon Ball Z vocals. I can't really go wrong with that. It was just for the vibe. So this is the finished product that I got. So with that being said, that's going to do it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I was just kind of have trying to have fun with this. Uh, I have been listening to Flying Lotus lately and listen to uh, Cosmo Grammar. And kind of inspired me to make this beat. So with that being said, make sure you guys like and subscribe. Leave down a comment and peace out.